Hello, welcome to Napco Video Tech Tips. This is Tom. Today I'm going to be going over how to change panel types in the quick loader if you're upgrading panels from one panel to a higher panel. It's actually fairly easy and we do get you know quite a bit of calls on this. So if you go into your software and let's say you have an 816 and now they want to put a, uh, a 1632 in, what you can do is highlight it go up to edit and then you'll see up here where you can select this you see how this becomes an area where you can select so you click on that and then it will go from the 816 and it'll give you the option of doing a 1632 now on the 816 you can upgrade to a 1632 so if you want to take an 816 panel and now they need more zones and you want to just put in a 1632 you can put in a 1632 by just clicking on the 1632 and you'll notice that you can only go from an 816 to a 1632 so if with that being said is if you wanted to go to a 1664 from an 816 you wouldn't be able to do that because there's so many different features in the 1664 than there are in either the 816 or the 1632. But moving forward, you can go from an 816 to a 1632. You click on that, and then you hit OK. And then it asks you, are you sure you want to change the panel type? Yes. OK, and then you just hit OK. Now, this panel is now a 1632. So if you go into your panel selection, you're going to see now it's a 1632. Now, if you want to go from a 3200, okay, you can go up with that as well. So you would do the same thing. You would click on 3200, you would click up to edit, and then you have the same selections up here as far as being able to change it. You click on that, and if you notice, you have a 9600 or a 255. So with a 3200, you can go up to 9600 or even as high as a 255. So if we wanted to change this to a 9600, we do the same thing. We just click on 9600, hit OK. Want to change the panel type? Yep. Yeah. And then you hit OK, and then it changes it to a 9600. Now 1664. Okay, since that's just a, a has so many different features than any of the other panels and it's programmed in such a different way with the way the four areas are and everything if you wanted to upgrade that and you wanted to put a higher panel in like a 3200 or you know, something of that sort you would have to create a new program okay you can also do this on the gem c panels okay so if you wanted to go in and you want to change a gem c from a 32 do the same thing Go up there, highlight it, go to edit, and then you click on the 32, and then you have the ability to go to a 96 or 128 or you know, whatever panel you want to use, and you would just go through the same process. And you would select, let's say we want to go at 96, we hit OK, you want to change it, and then you hit OK to apply, and now that changed it to a 96. Okay? The lower panels the p400 800 801s they can't be changed neither can the ma1000 panels but you do have the ability to do this with the gemini 816 to 1632 3200 to 9600 or 255 and it's as easy as that it saves you a lot of time if you're upgrading you don't have to rewrite the whole program you can just transfer it over right over to the newer panel by just changing the panel type and that's about it so it makes it a very easy upgrade if you want to do a new upgrade thanks for visiting napco video tech tips and have a good day